as I said, I was on the phone talking to our neighbor next door. And I said, oh, uh, I'm going to, if uh, there's someone at the door, I'll call you right back. And as I opened the door, he essentially shoved me back. And I, I, at that time, I had that phone in my hand. And I told him that I had just told the neighbor that he was breaking in and to call the police. And then he, since my husband was back in the back room, he kind of directed me back there. He, he didn't push or anything, but he made me go back there and kept telling me to stop yelling. And so we got back in the room and I was very nervous. I sat down and he went over and he took Roger's um, walker and put it in the living room turned upside down and he disabled the phone. And he kept saying, he, w he wanted to know if we had it uh, safe. I said, we did not, but that I had some money in the bedroom and he, we would give him everything we had, just don't hurt us. And he kept saying he wasn't going to hurt us, but he had this big knife. We walked back to the bedroom, to the desk, which had a lot of papers on it. He just went, riffled through the papers and started throwing things out from the uh, little file cabinet there. And I was searching for the money and then I looked and he was gone. And I ran out and Roger said he had run out the door.